Yes, good day everyone. This is your boy Kareem Noel, aka Kareem Dyer. Yes, well, we are here at the Kelly Meats and Distribution Shop Wholesale and Retailers. You need a meat? Come to this place right here. Okay, so we're going inside and we're going to purchase some pork today because today is the Trini Jira pork styling from your boy. Watch how we're going and do this one. So let me go inside and see how things inside here. Good blender. Should have done already. Blend up that, Michelle. You don't think so? Huh? This is a lot of goats here. How much goats is this? I am now testing these new utensils or new KitchenAid items that KBTV has just purchased. And I am fortunate to be the... Do you want experience in broadcasting? We are going to check out some of our shows. Meet interesting people. Hi to all the viewers of KVTV. You know we were the big boss. Hey you guys, Nisi here with KVTV. And yes, we're at the gym because we're about to start KVTV's very own fitness show. I want to I wanna make some Jira pork. I wonder if you have the, the, the pork in cubes. I can That would be nice. The budget, we could, you, you could buy about, let's say about $40, $30 worth of pork. You know, if I serve about five to, five to six people. You know, it's a cutters we're making, so $40 so, is good enough. So the yeah, yeah, that would be good. Look at how much pork we get here for just $30. And it already cubed up nice, you know, nice finger food size. So this should be real good, and it's only thirty-three dollars. We have how much change we get from hundred? Yeah, we come out good, man. We could even get them a little tips, <laughs> right? So we have it nice. We are here back on Sim Sima, and we are making jira pork today. Now we just came from the poultry shop, and it seems like look at it, the jira is the I'm sorry, the pork is frozen stiff, hard like big stone. So. What we're gonna do, by the meanwhile, we had to get a little more in ingredients, so we're gonna put this to soak, right? Um, and then we're gonna head down the road and get some ingredients, but first we really need to get this here soaked and toying out by the time we go the road to come back. Well, as you can see, we, are, we already have vegetable oil, but you, if you don't have this at home, you should get vegetable oil, you will need to get vegetable oil, and we also have a little curry powder here so we don't really need to get salt curry no vegetable oil right yes we are back here on sin sima we're going to buy goods by unibaba right this is what we're cooking is jira for dinner right so the first thing as we say we have oil the second thing we have the guys garlic you have to put garlic in the pot so what we need I mean, you don't buy single, you could buy single garlic, yeah. Come on, cheaper, they say. You have a hundred dollars. So, you buy two head of garlic, right? And the next thing is the main ingredients. See this here? Chief roasted jira. Cumin seeds. Also known as cumin, you know? Um, some places, you might see jira, you might go and you might see cumin. So don't, don't think it's, it's different, it's the same thing. So you could use cumin or you could use your sajira. Alright, um, the next thing we're going to get is some chief black pepper. Alright, and one last thing we're going to need is all-purpose seasoning. You could buy this kind, you could buy maggi, you could buy any other, once it's all-purpose seasoning, it's just for the flavor, right? So, but I like to use chief, chief is my product. Alright, this looks better. $2.15. So let's go and see how much this comes up to. So we're here by the cashier. As we say, we have $100 and we're going to make a big pot like Jira, Jira pork. So, how are you going, darling? I'm okay. It looks so nice today. Thank so, here are we to do. Give me a little bill here. Let me see how much this will come up to. Two fifteen, one fifty, four fifty, seven seventy five. Twenty dollars and sixty-five cents. What are you looking at? Jira pork. You can pass and get a little taste. You know, to see that there are some men out here that could real boss a good pot. <laughs> Thanks a lot, darling. This is Unibaba. Since Sima, we're going to boss Jira for dinner one time. 
Okay, we are here at DNC Fresh Vegetables ma, um, Mini Mart, and as you see, there's some nice good here. But what's the size of them? Look at it, real nice. Way. Well, yeah, so here we're going. We're coming to get the fresh seasoning here for the Jira pork. So, see, there's some shadow benny or what we would call it, bandana. Alright, so we could take about three or four of this. This, yeah, that's good, man. I'm always selling a shadow Benny here. Oh gosh, she's a boss. You hear the kind of fries? Best I take one more. Take out of the side. You gotta look for the nice, firm ones. Oh ho! And we gotta get hot pepper. So, where do you get hot pepper, moms? Right in the corner here. Look at these hot peppers. Look at them. Nice hot peppers. Just need about three. Because, as you say, it's a serving for four, four to five people. You know what? We should take a few pimentos. Just to add a little more flavor to this spot. Firm and smooth. You see, like, look at these. When you look at these, they're kind of wriggly. We don't want them, those, right? So we'll take nice, uh, smooth ones. Now, I just add in this cucumber. You don't necessarily need to get a cucumber. But I add in a cucumber. You know, sometimes you eat doubles. And, you know, they, they put a little side, side food on it, you know? A little taste of the side to, to give it a different flavor. You know, you put, you put cucumber, you put mango on top of your jira on the cup you know you have your white cup and you, you grate your cucumber this is what the cucumber is for so I roll with this the budget is a hundred dollars right so let me see how much more money I have here all right twenty four dollars all right and we done shop for this for this meal huh? and we still have twenty dollars you feel we can drink a little beer boy all right, that's what we're talking about. Let me go and drink a beer and eat some giraffe pork, right? Pot pan the fire water cooking for dinner. We have the pimentos here. It's just, let's uh, say, about four to five servings, so you don't need plenty. We have the hot peppers, a little parsley, thyme, about eight cloves of garlic chopped, and we're gonna dice up some onions here. We have the shadow benny, and the scythe. Black pepper, jira, all purpose. Yeah, we have all the oil as we said we had. And, well, that's basically it. Salt, all purpose seasoning. That's basically it, what we need for this dish. This trini dish, jira pork, the river lime meal. One onion is, is good enough. Just the flavor you want from the onions. And you gotta be careful with onions because as you see my eyes right now, it's kind of, I'm sorry to say. But my, my food's gonna taste so good. So here we have the side, shallow belly, onion and garlic. Now we go to the pimentos. I don't need to use the blender, you see. And I say when they use the blender, most of the times they always have to put the water in the blender. So when they put water, it thin it thin in this is this is in itself now. That is to me. I learned that from you know cooking in restaurants and that kind of thing, you know. Fresh seasoning is always better. Here we have the pork is already defrost, and you know some people they use lime. If you don't have lime, you can use a little vinegar, a little pork full, right, and and a half, right. And you get a good mix up. Take away all that freshness, and you rinse out that. Do you have half of this? You put it into half of this. And you put in three quarters of this. You don't really need much of this when you put in the yeah. This is how I do it. You mix it in, squeeze it together. Open. Pack. And well, normally you, you, you can take a teaspoon of jira and you drizzle it over your seasoning. But I'm custom doing this, so I don't need to have a teaspoon, I can average it. Right. A little touch of curry to season it also. Give us a good mix up. 
and you can leave this to settle for about 10 minutes. Just two hot peppers, they call this a mini pepper sauce. In most of the, most of the kitchen I cook jira in, you cook with pepper sauce to make jira. You know? So if you don't have pepper sauce, you have two hot peppers, you put in a little bit of water in your, your blender, drop in two, two hot peppers. You still have a little bit of side here. Right? That's a little thing you want. Sorry. Right? A little bit of shallow belly. And this remainder is what I was keeping back these fermenters for. You have a little water in there. And give it a little shake. Blender ain't working so good, Hamilton Beach. It's a good blender, but oh my gosh. <coughs> Time for us to get this to him. This is the part here where they have to be great when they cook it. Some people they have this and they like to use this in oil. The plastic spoon. Because they tend to get a little melted at the top and that's going into your food. So I'll have to use this short this short spoon. Now your the garlic is burnt. I'm showing some chira inside here. That's where you want. Don't feel a little burn. You know when I cook in, these things just happen. The oil splash up. How much do you put in this? Now I could average about four tablespoons, right? To burn. You guys, when they cook in jira pork, you gotta put a lot of jira. You know, the, 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 when they when they chew any meat and it boil down, you gotta put back more jira and water, and they burn down again. Guys, something that is gross, you know, it's something that is burn in the pot, and they get out of this too. All this seasoning here. This is what they call chunky. This is really hot right now. So this has been set for about 5 to 10 minutes. It could be longer, you know, you're making it from the morning. Better yet. The jira is burnt. And we're going in. This is how you create the water. The below is there and you leave that for about 5 minutes. By the time you raise up the pot again, you'll see water inside here. Here's like the side dish for the jira, you know? There's something on the side of it. Some people make cucumber with the skin. You can do it anyhow, skin or without skin. Cucumbers. It's a really good, it's a really good cutter, so it's like chow, you know? And you go on the Kora River, and you feel for a, a jira pork and chow. Yeah man, it's like a chutney. Cucumber chutney we call it. So you have a little black pepper, a little touch of black pepper, because it's not much, one cucumber. Let's see. That's good there. Eh? You take about two leaves of shadow benny. Alright. That goes in there. A little dash of salt. Oh my gosh, look at that. Alright, it creates its own water. That way, you get the full flavor. You can take water down. That sauce can be so nice. Now remember we just made a, a little pepper sauce. These pieces. And this is just to add a little color and spice to your salad. So now our jira has been cooking for about 10 minutes and we want to see how it's looking here. Let me show you, show you all the spots. And 
we have our this sauce here, look at this. This is a little spicy sauce, not so hot. But some people in trouble today. Nice. And we're gonna give this a little stir. What we didn't do is add a little more salt. Just a little more, because you don't want it too salty. That's it. And the last seasoning ingredient I use is a kind of chief man, you know? So, chief or proper seasoning, it works anyway. Now, a lot of people, when they're making chira, they, they want to use whole or they, or they use butter or something to, to add more flavor, but whole and is not healthy. Um, butter and thing when you're making it, you these things are not, it's too, too much cholesterol, high in cholesterol, so the less you can use, it's better. Alright? And that's that, yeah? That's all about, that's about three, tees, three tables, three tablespoons of seasoning, yeah? And at the end of the show, you're gonna get the exact amount of ingredients for a perfect chira. Okay, so let's get this a stir. Yes. This is a little spicy sauce, not so hot, but some people in trouble today. A little stir, add a little more salt. It's a kind of chief man, you know? So, chief or proper seasoning, it works anyway. Now, a lot of people, when they're making chira, they, they want to use whole or they, or they use butter or something to, to add more flavor, but whole and is not healthy. Um, butter and thing when you're making the chira, these things are not, it's too, too much cholesterol, high in cholesterol, so. The less you can use, it's better. I'm gonna give this another 10 minutes. Make a little sauce, a little jira sauce. Now we have made the blender with this remainder here. Nice. That's about another three teaspoons. Three tablespoons, sorry. And another touch of curry. Just a little touch. And you get this a stir. And you keep this. Just for when you're ready. When that dries down, you use this, tray back in, in again, and give it about 15 to 20 minutes, if so long, 20, 15 minutes. I throw a hot pepper in the pot. And as you can see, it's starting to get a little soft. Okay, down. The pot's a little deep. The giraffe's gonna stick to the bottom of the pot. Look at that, you see that right, right there? That is what you want to happen. Right? So that the jewel will actually burn and stick you guys, you will get the taste of your home jewel for. Remember we made this sauce here. Let's make this a little so again. Right? Because you want a little jewel to be on your sauce so you can throw on top of the cup. Right? Let me sure you get all that here. Okay, what uh, a. Let me show you where all that thick sauce. When it boils down, see this little thick sauce you see coming out there? When it boils down, you can be able to throw this on top of your jira as a little sauce. So, let's keep this thick sauce for another 15 minutes. So, you cover it for 3 minutes. And we take off the cover after the shimmies and let it cook just like that. So, jira pork is almost ready to be served. Right now, the pot is sim sima and we'll be back. Sim sima, pot pan the fire water cooking for dinner. So here we are again. We are about to finish up this jira. This is what it's looking. Oh my gosh, this is what you want to see. Right? Now as I say, I would like to use this plastic spoon, so I'll use this here. 
This is what I want. Do it dry. Don't put it dry. Let this pass you all over it here. So, what we're gonna do now? Let's switch off this too. There we go. Chira pork. Sim Sima. This is what we cook up for dinner. Chira pork. Yes. Lion heart is the cooker. Yes. So we are finished here with the Jira pork. Um, under hundred dollars. We have salad on the other side there. So when you dish it out into your cups, you know, you throw it on top of your, you throw your, your salad on top of your jira. Partner here, tell us your name please. Sean. Sean, right. Sean kind of shy with the TV. Yeah, but Sean, you ready to taste this? I want to try it. Da, 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 da. Yeah, you get through. Good. Good. So, Real good, real good. Everything, it didn't miss nothing. It's mm. spicy enough. More pepper. All right. Um, how about the salad? The salad on top, the chutney, perfect. the cucumber chutney. Perfect, perfect. Nice. So, okay, every TV you hear there? I'm missing out. They're missing, missing out. out. You're, missing hear, out. you're hearing that. Oh, of course, the Cody man getting down. <laughs> Thanks for having me again, KV TV. Um, this is your boy, Kareem. Chira pork was we dinner. Well, not dinner. It's lunchtime. It's, no, sun's still up. So, since simmer.